Welcome back to OT in a Pinch. Today I'm going to show you some activities that you can do with clothespins. With clothespins, you can encourage pinch strength, um, tip to tip, which is the index finger on top and the thumb on the bottom, the lateral pinch, where the thumb is on the top, or the tripod pinch, which then eventually is great for holding a pencil and doing other fine motor activities. I have cardboard, markers, clothespins, cotton balls, and an index card. I used my markers so that I could create different mediums so that we could work on matching um, colors, letters, you can match numbers, words, and even simple sentences as you continue to work on your hand strength. So I took the markers and I added different colors on my cardboard and I colored the clothespins on one side so that we could encourage, depending on what type of pinch strength you were trying to work on, to match colors. You can also work on matching letters. And the cardboard actually gives a nice resistance um, so that you're having to open up the clothespin a little bit more, which then increases more of the strength. With the index card, this is a great way to grade down the activity because you can just slide it in. And then as the student starts to increase their strength, you can move it to cardboard. Clothespins can also be used for picking up cotton balls, which helps with strengthening as well. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Remember to turn on post notifications to never miss another video. Thank you.